Jazz Alpha. It's time to take you through a couple tips and tricks on how to properly develop a double jab. PJ is on. So, there are a couple ways to do this. I would like to make sure we get the power for the jab to come from the rear foot and reload that lead hand back to your face each time. Boom, boom. Getting into the reloads. That's coming off of my back foot. And I would like to make sure that we are reloading the entire body up top, getting a good power reload on that. And that's just a stationary position. And those are four power jabs. Not every jab has to be a power jab. You can just flick and touch the double jab as well. Make it quick for distractions. As quick as I talk sometimes. Also, the double jab is used to close the distance. So if Coach PJ backs up, I can stay with him by pushing off with that back foot for that double jab. Now what if Coach PJ is upset at me now and he's stepping forward? I use the double jab again to go backwards. But then I'm going to be pushing off with my lead foot, okay? So whatever direction you go, you can move the opposite foot. If I go forward, I'm using my back foot. Moving back, I'm using my lead foot. I want to make sure I have a solid target when I'm doing those double jabs. Another thing is to double jab towards your lead hip, getting away from him, but I don't want you to line up for his right hand. So to be able to have the reaction pull out of the way of that. Another thing that you can do is pan them backwards with the rear hip on the double jab as well. It's very similar to how I got the fastest knockout. Second fastest knockout. Thank you, Jorge Mask and all. But again, for the double jab to develop good habit, good technique from the beginning, get a good full, solid reload, do it in position, do it forward, go backwards, do it towards your lead hip, do it towards your rear hip. I want to make sure you stick every double jab, okay? Now here with Coach PJ, in position, double jab, he'll go forward, he'll go backwards. I like for him to go towards his lead hip, now he'll square back up, he'll do it towards his rear hip. So we're doing this double jab in position, forward, backwards, lead hip, rear hip. There are some tips and tricks for your double jab. Coach, thank you, sir. Here we go, glass hoppers.